The Science of Being Well by Wallace D. Wattle Chapter 8 continued Use your willpower to withhold your attention from every appearance of disease in yourself and others. Do not study disease, think about it, nor speak of it. At all times when the thought of disease is thrust upon you, move forward into the mental position of prayerful gratitude for your perfect health. The mental actions necessary to being well may now be summed up in a single sentence. Form a conception of yourself in perfect health and think only of those thoughts which are in harmony with that conception. That, with faith and gratitude, and the purpose to really live, covers all the requirements. It's not necessary to take mental exercises of any kind, except as described in the chapter titled, Use of the Will, or to do wearying stunts in the way of affirmations, and so on. It is not necessary to concentrate the mind on the affected parts. It is far better not to think of any part as affected. It is not necessary to treat yourself by auto-suggestion, or to have others treat you in any way whatever. The power that heals is the principle of health within you, and the call to this principle into constructive action. It is only necessary, having harmonized yourself with the all-mind, to claim by faith the all-health, and to hold that claim until it is physically manifested in all functions of your body. In order to hold this mental attitude of faith, gratitude, and health, however, your external acts must be only those of health. You cannot long hold the internal attitude of a well person if you continue to perform the external acts of a sick person. It is essential not only that your every thought should be a thought of health, but that your every act should be an act of health performed in a healthy manner. If you will make every thought a, a thought of health and every conscious act an act of health, it must infallibly follow that every internal unconscious function shall come to be healthy, for all the power of life is being continually exerted toward health. We shall next consider how you may make every act an act of health. You need to subscribe to this channel. You need to subscribe to this channel. You need to subscribe to this channel. Subscribe to the Artistic Biker now. Click the buttons.